Hello and welcome to the fifth episode of How to Be a Better Rust Electrician. In this, in this episode today, I want to uh, pretty much show off a new technique that I discovered. Um, there's a gentleman called Hondox who joined my Discord and was asking for a little bit more insight on how configure siphons work or C buses from my episode two. And he posed me with the question of it, you know, whenever I turn this bus off, instead of spinning that electricity, is there a way that I could reclaim, or is there, was there a way that he could reclaim that energy? And my first initial thought was, no, it doesn't work that way, yada, yada, yada. But then I remembered about the knee capacitor that knee came up with. And I thought about the mechanic, and if you don't know how knee capacitor works, uh, watch my previous episode, uh, episode four on early game progression. But what you can do is send power to a microphone, and whenever you do, it converts it from an audio signal, because this is, or excuse me, from a power signal, into what's considered an audio signal, which is different from the game. Now, you can't route audio signals into your power generation, but you can run them into a splitter, and splitters can be ran into root combiners, so it basically allows you to kind of glitch the game and exploit it into basically allowing you to take this power and hook it back in. And so what I've done here is I've taken the you know last part of my um, my power delivery system right here where you see I have 35 energy coming through, and I'm sending it to this microphone stand. And then from the microphone stand, I'm running it to this splitter. And then from the splitter, I'm running it up here where my power generation comes in, excuse me, uh, where all my wind turbines come in. And it's allowing me to actually send it through, and I'm sending it back to the knee core. And basically what this is allowing me to do is uh, divert energy. Here we go. So now we're actually charging again. So you'll see right now we're adding about one second every two seconds. You know, we're adding power in. Going up by one and then it goes up a little bit, right? But if I were to come over here and flop that switch, it should start gaining a lot slower. As soon as I say that, it starts going faster. Anyway, this is really hard to show on the server, but anyway, what's basically happening is we're taking all this power that's excess. Like right now, we're not sending any extra power. We're sending 34 power. So that 34 power that's left over on the circuit is making its way back into the batteries. And since batteries can charge and discharge at the same time, we, we don't have an issue. But as soon as I come over here and I flip it, you know, now we're not doing that and we're just sending power. Or excuse me, we're not, uh, we're not sending any power phone or any excuse me, power to our, uh, I think I'm going to call this the knee replication edition or something like that. I don't know. We'll find a name for it. But basically, we're not sending any power over here, so no extra power is being added into the battery from what we sent. But um, I don't know. I just wanted to make this quick little video to show this off because, you know, uh, a lot of people think that a configure siphon allows you to click it and then, or excuse me, to toggle it, and now you're using less energy. You're really not all you're doing is is basically saying hey out of this energy i have here uh i'm not sending it on this circuit maybe i can enable one further down the line but um anyway uh that's pretty much all i wanted to say uh again thanks to um i don't get his name wrong hondox he uh, joined my discord server a couple uh, hours ago and was asking uh, a question about this and it really just kind of put the thought in my mind it got me thinking about it so uh you know if you, if you any of you people uh, people excuse me if any of you guys ever want to reach out to me you can join my discord server in private DM me in private or just talk in the server uh, either one works but uh thank you for watching and yeah uh have a good one